Okay, here we go. We're gonna let the guests know that this batch just came right out of the oven, and we're gonna call from the front to let them know there's still one to wait for the fresh cone that's are coming. All right, you guys are still here. You're excellent. The cronuts are coming out, so you haven't got a chance to taste it. You will now. Okay, awesome. If you want a second, we might have a little bit extra too. Just see how it is first. Okay. Thank you. You're you're a gentleman. <laughs> awesome. Would you like to try it also? Oh, you're on the way out. We're having what's called a cronut. You guys want to taste it? It's a almost like a flaky, buttery layer of croissant, but it's not baked like a croissant is fried. You guys like to try when we're serving them as our courtesy for our guests, for example. You want to taste it? It's very nice. And we just want to ask you for our guest reaction. Okay, great. Have a seat. We'll serve it out to you. Okay. Okay. We're just busy here with the advance of the curling here. He's going to give us some time here for a cool down. And the guests are going to get a treat because we're actually putting our house whipped cream here, as you can see. It's nice and almost like not just the one that you can spray on. It's a very much a richer and thicker, but still light in taste. So as soon as the baker is ready, he's going to go ahead and uh, uh, dip into some sugar. Let, kind of let the oil seep through. Yes, right here. We're just waiting on uh, the master baker, but not Sal, uh, to come and uh, finish up the, the final blazing touch. Okay, there he goes. The baker is doing his uh, final prep. As you can see here. And, okay, so now he's got the sample trays here. And that way he can, he can put the whipped cream and everything. You have about eight people waiting for it. Uh, haven't tasted yet, so they're going to get a taste of it. And there's more to come. Um, Do it in a little bit more professional way in a smaller scale. He's filtering the sugar from the particles here in the last fried batch. That's how he does it. Okay. His assistant's helping him put the pure sugar here. Rolling all the time. That's it. Off with the whipped cream. Okay, just a few more moments. the pan very delicately. These are much lighter than the batches we made on day two. Okay. And you're just putting it in the refrigerator to keep it cool a little bit. Okay. Root. Milk the sugar, okay. And then or also the cream as well. So we have guests waiting out there. Just be shortly. And he's going to prep the 